There's a mini city under construction on M Street at 29th that looks like a good blueprint for the care, feeding, and protection of a population that's been on our collective minds for a couple years now, the homeless. The county's low barrier homeless navigation center, due to open in late February, is not the entire answer, but it sure looks like an important piece of it. Two huge silver tent-like structures, a passerby might think he's looking at a couple of docked UFOs, will provide sleeping quarters for 150 people and potentially more. There will even be an area for animals. I visited the site with Chief Administrative Officer Ryan Alsop, who showed me around. So we've got six acres, we've got some existing buildings that will be repurposed, and we have two huge tent-like structures? Yeah. Is that, Cent what, what would you characterize them? Yeah, uh, these are high-tension fabric tents built by Sprung. It's a company, and uh, they do this uh, professionally around the state and have done it in other communities. And as you can see, they've come in and built them. And now we have another contractor that was recommended by Sprung. They're in here uh, getting it all squared away with plumbing, electrical, uh, lighting, all of that stuff has to be done, utilities, and, uh, and then everything else, the retrofit of some of these existing facilities will be happening um, uh, both concurrently and following um, th these things getting squared away and done. The facility in an industrial area sits on about six acres, only half of which will be used for now. And the shelter will be staffed by employees of Kern Medical and several county agencies. An area near the tracks has been set aside for as many as 50 cars to accommodate what we might call long-term car campers. Will the Homeless Navigation Center put a dent in Bakersfield's homeless problem? We should know in a few weeks. For the Bakersfield Californian, this is Robert Price.